Hello everyone and welcome back to, well, the first In Rays of uh, Light uh, episode. Uh, probably only be one, uh, I'm not really too sure. But yeah, uh, obviously thanks for the devs for the key to this game. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's some sort of mystery, sort of, yeah, just a mystery game. Uh, it's actually got a next-gen version, so I suppose maybe we'll see some, you know, some of the hectic feedback, or I don't know, it's optimised for next-gen. Yeah, it's sort of in, I suppose... Sort of Chernobyl, um, but yeah, it's got that similar setting to it. So you know, post-Soviet Union, you know, everything's all overgrown. And I mean, look, nature has actually reclaimed the building. Um, so yeah, I don't know what we're doing. Uh, all I know is that there's some sort of ending to the game, and we have to get to that ending. There's not really any sort of well, there's nothing. You load in to this. Um, so yeah, let's just see if we we can do anything. Um, but yeah, obviously thanks again to these oh hello developers for the code for the game. There is a game audio. I uh, turned it down. Actually, I might turn it up a little bit now. But there was actually some music at the start. There you go. I think the music's gone now, uh, which is all right. Hello everyone and welcome to an In Rays of Light um, episode sort of first look. Um, but yeah, it's some sort of mystery game obviously thanks to the developers for the code. We'll probably do a couple of episodes uh, on this. But yeah, some sort of mystery game. Uh, it's got a next gen version as well. Um, but yeah, we're trying it out and I believe it is out now. Um, yeah, but we're going to have a little look through it. Um, yeah, but it's, it's in sort of, I suppose, it's got that Chernobyl feeling to it. I think it is sort of supposed to be set. Chernobyl, you know, when everything's overgrown, everything's abandoned. And, yeah, it's got a lot of mystery about it. But, I mean, that is the point of the game. Um, but, yeah, it's, uh, we're going to get into it and we're going to see what we need to do. Literally, this is what you load into. There's not really anything telling you what to do. Um, but yeah, I believe this is actually a remake of a game which came out in 2012. I think that one's called Rays of New Light or something like that. Uh, but yeah, I think this is sort of a remake. Uh, or at least sort of an upgraded version. Uh, but let's just see what what we need to do. Can we get any of this? What are the controls? Okay, well that's to get a little cursor. If you press the right analog stick, what's this say? The light will lead you. Alright, let's press X, I guess. Oh, press X. Oh, there are hands there. Very detailed, isn't it? See all the veins in the hands and all. Cool. Okay, we've got a light, so that's triangle. Boom, boom. <laughs> right, so, I, I don't know what... Uh, we'll go this way. I don't think... I think this game is... Uh, I don't think it's sort of a horror game, so... It should be fairly family-friendly. Um. So I suppose yeah, we're trying to find stuff, I guess. Find clues or to what has happened or... What, can we open these? Oh, we can open these. That's nice, that a picture of a field there. Yeah, very mysterious. Right, let's get this one open. Can we get this one open? No, I can't open that one. Yeah, but hopefully everyone's well. Um, how's, yeah, how's everyone doing? Hopefully everyone's all well today. Okay, not much in this room. Uh, I just don't know what we're in at the moment, we're in some sort of school, or... It does seem like a school, or like an office. What are we saying, is this a school? Not too sure. Um, I think this still goes back into the starting room, doesn't it? No, we can't open it anyway. Okay, uh, what's in there? We've got a bathroom in here. I don't know, it, it looks brilliant. Uh, obviously, yeah, this is the next-gen version. Uh, it does. It does look good, doesn't it? And the flies buzzing. Lots of detail has gone into this. Not very clean toilets, are they? Um. Hmm. So we need to find things. Uh, I haven't actually seen really any gameplay. Oh, hello. We'll take that. Inventory. That's R1. So. Oh, I see it. You get a few slots on there. Okay. Um. Lovely. So, what can we do with this? <laughs> what can we do? We need to say... No, no, don't go on there. The music will start then. I don't want the music going on. Let's have a look. What's in here? Um, not a lot. Anything in here? Uh, this must be a school. It's either a school or an office. 
we're looking for at the moment. Right, this is... I suppose we need a whack list, can't we? What's that? I can hardly see that. Okay, hold X. Well, tap X. Oh, I see, so that sort of gets the doors. Okay, well, we're out of this area now. Bye, guys. Let's get the door shut. What is that? Whoa. What's all that mist? And this should be family friendly, this game. Uh, there's no uh, sort of zombies or anything, and it literally is just a mystery game. But it's brilliant, obviously. Nice and chilled out. Can we get in there? Yes, yeah, so I don't expect there to be a zombie which pops out of one of these doors. I think I'd be very surprised as well. Um, hmm, why is this like a blocked up door? That looks suspicious. Why is that blocked up? We can't whack that, can we? That does seem a bit suspicious. Look, that's a door frame there. But it's blocked up. It's got to be... Right, there's got to be a way into there. Oh, can we get out here? Oh, we can get out. Well, I don't really want to be get... Oh, can we get out? No, we can't. Surely you can smash the glass. Maybe not. So we probably need to turn the power on, if there is any power. Um... But yeah, what I was saying, yeah, I haven't really seen any gameplay of this game um, before. I saw like a snippet of it, uh, and that's about it. It's like a siege barrier with a little X on it. Let's have a little look, and then we'll go into it. What's this? What's this? So there's some sort of building, or... I don't know what that is. He's putting his hand out. Some sort of performing performer, don't know, doing some sort of cool thing. Can we read this? What's that say? Don't know, it's all in Russian or whatever language it is. Right, we can go in here. Locks. Okay, so we probably need to find the key. Oh, wow, there's a lot. There's a lot going on here. Okay, hold L2 to run. Um, so, key. Where would you put a key? So I'll put in the chat, where would you hide the key? There's a fire extinguisher there. Why can't we hit the door? Keys. Oh, there's a map here. Oh, hello. It actually comes up with uh, something on there. I can't read it, but... There you can see, look, what's that? PA and something. So I'm guessing... Oh, there's quite a lot on here, actually. So I don't know if this is like a post-apocalyptic world, actually. I mean, if it's all these little bits in here. I'm just trying to have a look. Uh, Africa, why is it like a massive country there? Or like, you know, all these countries bundled together. Is this like set in the old times or something? I'm, I'm trying to have a little look here. No, I don't think it, that is, that would be the, I think that's just sort of simply the colour of the map, I think. I was, I was thinking this, if this was set a while ago, that could be empires. So, I know France did, um, obviously have most of that side of Africa. But I don't think it is anything to do with that. Um, okay, oh, there's a bus down, so it wouldn't be. I'm looking for a key. It's going to be somewhere in here, isn't it? I mean, hopefully we can find it. Can't open them. Can't open them. Anything behind here? What's this? Oh, no, nothing. Okay, nothing in this room, so let's run out of here. Uh, let's go into... You know, we'll try this. I bet it's in here, isn't it? Can we open that? No, we can't. Um, oh. Some bits and bobs here. It's a phone. I thought we'd better ring it then. It'll, I don't know, it'd be some dodgy guy on the other side. Um, yeah, looking out for a key. Help me. Oh, what's this? There is no regret that... There is no regret, we all deserve it. Is that all that says? There is no regret, we all deserve it. Don't know. Uh, okay, nothing in this room. Let's go into this room. Can we go in here? That one needs the key as well. Okay, we can't go in there then. Number seven. This seems... Like something could be in here. Oh, bridge. What's that? I don't know where that is. It's a big bridge, though. I'm guessing that probably is a real bridge somewhere. Probably round here. Okay, that was just for that one there. Key. 
Keys, where are you? Hopefully the visibility is all right for you guys. I know it's a little bit dark. Oh. oh. It's a good idea to check this wardrobe. That's not happening anymore. We've just been chucked it out. We've got a trophy as well. Oops. I don't know if we were supposed to do that, but oops. Yeah, we're looking for the key. I mean, hopefully we can find it here somewhere. Uh... Uh, okay. Uh, let's uh, get this one open. I'm guessing we can. Yeah, we can wipe this one. There we go. Let's get that off. Planks prevent the door from opening. Planks. Oh yes, we got it open now. Right, the key's got to be in here. Surely. We literally had to break the door down to get in it. All this so. When you understand the Odis, the images will give an answer. What's this? A mig? Yeah, was that a jet from the 50s, 60s time? Um, oh, there's a... Hello. Let's put 1, 2, 3 in there, or 1, 1, 1. Okay, so... Well, I suppose we're looking out for a number now. So now we need to look out for numbers. Right, okay. Let's, uh... Right, none of them open there. Nothing in it. So we're looking out for a number now to open that. That's quite a big area, isn't it? Um, looks nice though, doesn't it? Nice uh, visuals on it. What's over here? Some sort of electrical panel. Oh, maybe not. Nothing there, nothing there. I'll go downstairs in a second, see if we can find anything down there. There's a lot of rooms to check. Uh, a lot of rooms. So you know what? Um, I'm going to... What is that? That's not what I think it is, is it? No. Oh, we can we can take that. Ah, oh, I see. That's a light. Oh, awesome. The lighting on here. Yeah, I'm going to say it again. It looks brilliant. We've got a plane as well. Uh, is that a drawing or something on a telly? Uh, but yeah, I'm going to skip ahead. And you'll probably find me when I next find something interesting for you guys to see. So, hold on a sec. Let me quickly have a look at this. Yeah, I'll see you guys in a second when we might have found something a bit more interesting. Hold on a sec. Right, let's just hope the music isn't copyright uh, copyrighted. Um, yeah, I, I, I sort of went outside and then a bird flew in through the window. It's said, glad to see me. So, and but we found keys. We got them. So it was inventory. I suppose it probably does it anyway, doesn't it? Yeah, we've got, I hope it's not copyright the music, although I... Doubt it is, but you never know. Um, right, so we've got keys. Let's see, can we find anything else? What's that there? That's kind of pretty. I can hardly see that. I'm sort of turning my head the other way to try and see it. Don't know who they are. I suppose Soviet leaders or something. Um,. Anything in here? Oh, we've got keys, so we can go and open some bits and bobs up now. What's this? Another guy and some other place. Yeah, let's go and do that. Let's go and open up one of the doors. Uh, there was actually a door... Where was it? It wasn't this way. It was over here, I think. There was a door. Can we open this? No, where is it? Upstairs. Alright, we'll quickly, um, quickly go upstairs. Yeah, it's very suspenseful and calming, the music. Can we open this? Door is locked. Well, what does that door go to, then? I doubt it was this one over here. I mean, it might have been this door over here. What, was, what one was locked again? Uh, it was around here, wasn't it? Uh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, yes, it was this one. Awesome. Okay, well, we're now in this room. I bet there was nothing in there, was there? It's very... Oh, this must be some sort of hall. Oh, awesome. Yeah, it's a theatre. Of some sort. I haven't been to one of these in a long time. Well, I think cinemas are, are open now. I think. Um, Do my little speech. Got all the subs, you know. Chilling up there. Do my speech about... Oh, what's this? It's strange, but every item that had been forgotten or lost by someone, every word that had been scratched into the surface of a table or a chair, might be a significant part of history here. Interesting, in the future, will this 
matter just as we value ancient Greek amphro amphrae. I don't know that word. I mean, I should. I probably do know it, but... <laughs> um, anything? Oh, hello. Secret little room. Anything? Oh. Um, no. There's, oh, there's something here. Oh. Does not work. No electricity. Ah, oh, so I suppose it might have actually played a video. Which might have given us some sort of clues. Quickly just see if there's anything on these rows of chairs. Right, so we've got the tape player up here. Projector looks fine, but there's no tapes and electricity. So we need to find a generator. Where do you keep generators? Uh, they wouldn't be upstairs, would they? If you guys owned a school or college or whatever, where would you keep a generator? Um, I'm I'm thinking just like in movies and more right. And you are, have a choice: go out on the right or stay in the dark. I'll go out into the dark, stay in the dark. We've been down these stairs, have we? I would probably keep a generator downstairs. Uh, uh, probably. Admittance commission. Let's go in there. Wait, no, we can't go in there. Oh. No, I think it's a key. So the key opened the door upstairs, which there wasn't really much up there. Um, no, oh, a bit of uh, propaganda, propaganda or something there. Um, toilet, lovely. Why is there two toilets in the same room here? Oh, there's three of them. That'd be a bit awkward, wouldn't it? It's, you know, they're all sitting together, having a loo. That would be weird, wouldn't it? Right, let's uh, let's go along. <clears throat> What's there? That's the lock one, isn't it? Let's. We need to find the power generator. Uh, oh, what's this here? Another letter. We got an instruction from the director to fix the reserve generator, which was located in the basement. Okay, so it's down downstairs. Supposedly we had many problem cases with the electricity. However, there hasn't been a pro any problem with the electric lately. It was an old generator, which has got two hose, from the days of the Soviet Union, so we might get some extra time to fix it. Okay, so... Oh, yes, light. Uh, look at the lighting, though. All the shadows and... It's brilliant. So we need to find, I suppose... Oh, there's a wrench there, I think. Can we get that? No, is that a wrench? So we need to find a way to get down into the basement. Which I'm guessing was probably stapler there. Keys. Yes. Okay, we got keys. I reckon that one does. There was a. Is this the locked door here? No, that one's not locked. But there was a locked door somewhere in the school. Uh, let's try and find it. Run, 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 run. What's this? Oh, it's one of those uh, machines, isn't it? Doesn't want no electricity. Okay. We've already been here. I'm getting lost now. Is this the one? Yes. I think that was the one which was locked. So we got through there, which didn't really do a lot. How many keys have we got? We've still got a couple of keys, I think. So I think we've already checked here. Yeah, we've already checked here. The thing's open. So the basement. I'm guessing that'll be in the dark corner door somewhere. So it's not under there. Where would you put an entry to the... Oh, Teddy. Where would you put a basement... Well, where would you put a basement entrance? Uh, where would I put a door to the basement? I'd put a door to the basement. Probably not outside. Actually, you might have it outside on the exterior. Like you see in, sort of in the US, they sort of have the doors to the basements on the outside. But I reckon we're looking somewhere... Basement. Basement. Where's the door to the basement? Well, probably not going to be in here, is it? Well, it's obviously going to be on this floor, isn't it? So we need to keep looking. Dark corridor there. Where do you put a basement? Where is the basement? I reckon it's outside, isn't it? I suppose to stop students going down there from in school. Well, 
I'm going to go and have a little run outside, and I'll see you all in a second. Right, well, I was just sort of wandering around the school, just enjoying the nice, you know, nice scenery uh, here. It's actually quite nice, actually. Um, I came across, the, so this was the wardrobe we pushed out the window from up there, I guess. I found it. Here it is. So, let's get some keys. Uh, it looks like a key for the basement. Oh, from the basement. From the basement. <laughs> Okay, so we've just got the key from the basement in the wardrobe, which we chucked out the window earlier on. So, where is the basement? So, we're sort of scanning the outside, because, you know, sometimes basement entrances are on the outside. Um, so, there's a basement somewhere here. But where? Um, there's not a staircase. Oh, there's the music again. I really do hope that's not copyrighted. Have we been in here? It's like, um... If you ever played uh, Call of Duty, uh, zombies on there. Um, obviously the Juggernaut machine looks very similar to that. Um... Right, so we're looking out for a basement, but where's the basement? That's the same door to the last one, isn't it? So it wouldn't be there. Yeah, it's not going to be there either. Maybe it's not in this main building. Maybe there's like a tunnel to get under here. I see. Yeah, there wouldn't be. I don't think there'd be like a secret staircase down from the second floor. But we've got the key for the basement, so that's good. But the thing is, where is the basement? Now that's not going to be in the toilets, is it? Yes, so we've got the key, but it's just finding where it is. And that's the annoying thing. <laughs> where is the basement? You think they'd have like a door with a sign saying basement? We've already checked around here, haven't we? Yes, it's not going to be around here. I don't think there'd be some sort of secret door to the basement, is there? Basement? Where do you put a basement door? You think it would be. Uh, it's, not, it's not here anyway. I don't think there's a secret door from in here somewhere. Oh, what's this? No, that's not it. So I think this must be what their sort of headmaster's office. Yeah, it's not going to be in here, is it? So we're looking for that basement. They're not really having any uh, a good time looking for it so far. Oh, we've already checked it, yeah. Well, we'll do those doors again. Give them a little go. See if we can do anything. Doesn't look like it. So, I reckon we go outside. Um, yeah, we'll go outside again. I mean, the way the key was outside, maybe it means there'll be an entrance outside. I mean, there's this building over here, which might be part of the school. I don't know if we can go over here. I don't know if there's going to be some sort of barrier to stop us. I know we can go out over it. Can we? I don't know, doesn't look like we can go in here. That looks like to be sealed up. Well, let's, let's click on exit. I don't see any keyhole. No, there's nothing there. So I don't know if we are supposed to be out here. Yeah, there's an invisible barrier there, so it doesn't look like uh, we can do a lot. Although, there should be a basement somewhere. I don't know why I'm looking for a basement in the middle of the road. But that's what we do here. We look for things in the middle of nowhere. Although, it could be some sort of... You know, there could be something out here we need. So we may as well get it now. Uh, anything in the skip? No, I don't look like it. So this is, so it's pretty much this school. That is the map, I suppose. What's this here? Some sort of information? No, it's just a table. Oh, we can see, no, we can't go there. There's another invisible barrier. Can we go in here? Is it some sort of other part to the school? No, it does look like we can go in here. It's locked. I bet the key for that's in the basement, isn't it? <laughs> Where's the basement, though? So so we can go in there. So I'm guessing that's some sort of, I don't know, younger part of the school or something. Right, so we found that. But w what else is here? What else can we do? Still need to try and find that basement, so what I'll do is I'll see you all again 
in a second and maybe we might have found the basement i didn't find the basement but i did break into a bus just as i do you know break into a bus and it says the dispatcher suddenly halted his itinerary and instead went in another direction he warned that it was very important to bring them all to the final destination during that trip we took 10 more new people we had reached a spot but without an ex any explanation we were divided into groups and we were sent to the building yeah, maybe it's not a school i mean i don't know uh, i mean uh, why would they come here oh we did find some fuel as well so i suppose that could be for the generator which maybe the basement is close by where's the basement i'll see you all again in a second ah well basement was literally just out i'm pretty sure we ran out this door to start off with and probably ran past this so here's the basement I, how did i miss that i don't know if i was going the other way but <laughs> we somehow missed it um th this is the basement there we go and we go hello hello anyone in it oh, the lights already on that's convenient oh the music's gone all different it seems like very dingy and i don't like it right what's this say not one of those notes again uh, we divided people into groups for the sake of control. A crowd of a few hundred people formed, making things a bit complicated. There was mass. There was no panic. Most of them realised the gravity of the situation, which was better for everybody. People were making jokes, discussing something, and were trying to maintain their morale. The old door was opened easily. Groups of young people started to carry everything upstairs: tables, pallets, boxes of food. So maybe this is Chernobyl. And sort of this is the evacuation or something. So everyone sort of had to come here to. You know, whilst it's all being sorted, because I know when it first happened, people said, you know, it would be gone for a few days. Um, obviously, that wasn't the case. Why well, is like a secret vault door? Don't know. Right, so there should be a generator down here. Well, it should be. Which is right there. There's a generator. I don't know what that says. It's all in Russian. We've got another lighter there. We'll take that. Another little lights on here. Okay, well, we've got... Oh, hello. The fuse. Ah, the fuse. Where's the fuse? So now we need the fuse. Seems to be operational. Oh, fuel. Yes, we did have fuel, didn't we? Need to install the fuse. Where's the fuse? Fuse. Oh, is that going to be in here somewhere? I mean, hopefully it is, because I was have to go all the way back up. Right, there's got to be a fuse in here, you know, there's got to be, like, spare parts around here. So we need to find a fuse. Some sort of gas mask there. Fuse, where would you keep a fuse? There's got to be, you know, spare parts in here. Well, right, we didn't check the middle, did we? So we'll go back there in a second. But let's try and find the fuse. I sort of know what a fuse looks like from, uh, from plugs and all that. Fuse. Well, I don't think they'd keep it upstairs because why would you keep a fuse upstairs? I don't know. I can't see anything here. Lots of pipes working. Fuse. Not too sure. Well, I'm going to go and have a little stroll and uh, see if I can go and find that fuse. Oh, what's this over here? Oh, no, that was nothing. Right, I'll see you all in a second. It seems to be in lag as well for some reason. Hold on. I've got a genius idea. Uh, whilst I was actually off video, I was having a little look at um, sort of just around the area, as you sort of saw. Uh, and there's sort of a, a twine on here, which is like sort of a, sort of like a wooden sort of base thing. So we got a lighter, so surely we can burn it. Maybe... Oh no, there we go. Cool. Well, we're in here. This is some sort of dangerous place. But I mean, look at that. It's brilliant. Can't go in there. Can we push it? No, we can't push that. Uh, oh, well, this looks like a place where they keep a spare fuse. Very much does look like it. Some sort of big thing here. Don't know. Well, we're in here, so let's try and find a fuse. Fuse. Can we find a fuse in here? What's this? 
I left everything in the lockers. I washed and oiled the parts. Everything was okay. The second door is slightly harder to close, but it works normally. If I start pulling the other doors, uh, it's funny. The clock stopped running as it should. Tomorrow, I'll bring the batteries. Well, if tomorrow it was bringing the batteries, then that's not too good. Fuse. Fuses, where, where are you? Copy in here, come on. Fuse. What's that? No, I can't do anything there. Can I open all these up? Is that, there seems to be lots of top hats. Well, there's got to be a fuse in here, isn't there? One of these. Hmm, that one you can't open. Okay, well, doesn't see anything in there. What about in here? Okay, well, there's not a lot in here. Not as much as I sort of expected to find, uh, apart from, well, this. Which I don't think we can do anything with. Okay, um... Well, I suppose we'll head back out and, yeah, we'll, we'll head out and find somewhere else to go. But look at the lighting, it looks brilliant. Right, so what I ended up doing was literally just playing around with all of the lockers, just sort of randomly closing them, just to try and get this one to open. Just literally sat there for about 10 minutes doing it. And with this sort of nice combination, it seemed to open up. So we got a fuse. So that means we can now run back to the basement. It should just be over, but it's not that far, is it? Over here. Let's run back. Oh. What's that? An air raid alert has been declared. Oh, hello. So immediately go to the nearest defences, building basements, underground metro stations. This is uh, interesting, isn't it? Right, well, let's, uh, well, let's head back. But we are going to the basement. That's cool, isn't it? Brilliant. That does it good. Don't know what this sort of world is. I mean, it's the Soviet Union, so I don't know. But the end of the Soviet Union. I don't know. Oval. I really don't know. Getting that lag again there. We and here we go. We have power. We have got power. And even the trophy says, "Let there be light." That's not that good. I want to go upstairs. Hello. No, let me go up. I want to go and have a look. No, we can't get out. Okay, so the building above us is... I don't know what's going to happen to it. But... This has opened up. I suppose this is the school shelter. So we can go through here now, which is cool. Oh, there you go. That's the building above, just not being a building anymore. It's quite cool to see the map change. It's all flooded down there. I can feel it in the controller. The controller's vibrating quite a bit, so obviously that's the above building, I don't know, collapsing maybe. Um, I suppose we need to find the way out. Oh, that's not good. It's getting all dark, I don't like it. Well, I, I do want to go that way, but then there was the other way there. Can we get the um, fire? Yeah, we've still got the fire. We'll use that instead of the... Light isn't really working. I'm getting lost now. I'm getting lost. What way did we come from? Right, we came from that way. Right, let's check this way. Let's go and see what we can find over here. Not really too sure how long this episode's going to be. Um, but I'm enjoying this, so we're going to continue it. What the hell? <laughs> I could hear someone else. This is... It's not supposed to be a horror game, it's a mystery game, so... It's some sort of maze, isn't it? Of course there's a maze. Of course there's a maze. Of course there had to be a maze. I don't know where we're going, we're going somewhere. Okay. Oh my god, we've just gone... That's, that was a circle. Okay, well what's in here then? There's a bathroom in here. 
was light light in here what's this say who gave you oh we got another one of these notes people carefully settled down in the cramped hells of the dungeon halls one could feel the rising pressure and it was time to tell everybody that what was going on oh there was silence in the hall everybody was digesting what they had heard and a horror of reality was coming slowly the silence was broken by a din from outside everything was trembling plaster and dust had started to fall down from the walls and rooftops it looked as if there was a real hell and the ground beneath us had shifted the cannonade of sounds was filled with a howl a rumble of exploding bombs roaring like the noise of aircraft engines yeah well what's going on though it's just a big question. And how do we get out of here? So you sort of you want to know what's happened, but it, it, it didn't tell us. And I don't know where we go because that was the only other way. Unless there was another way we could go. And maybe we can go back up now. Yeah, maybe we can go back up actually. I don't think we can go that way again. But let's go back. Oh, there's another one. No, that's not another way. Yeah, let's try and go back now. I mean, my controller stopped vibrating. So I'm guessing we might be able to go back up now. I don't know if it would have opened up. Might have. Well, I'll be... Sirens are still going, so maybe not. But maybe yes. Oh, is it open? No, it's still closed. Well, we will hate that sound of the air raid siren, it's just, uh Kind of sort of iconic sounds, isn't it? Um, Let's go back through here, I don't like going through here. The way the light's flickering, hopefully visibility is alright for you guys. This is pretty dark. There's got to be another way, isn't there? Um, this is far from here. But then there's nothing in the bathroom, apart from flood and... It does look good though, doesn't it? You can see that the texture in the water. I need to get that light off. That light's irritating me. How do we get the light off? No idea how we get the light off. So we've got to keep the light for now, unfortunately. There's nothing here, but... I think we have to go back through the maze. We'll go this way this time. Maybe that will make a difference. It seems to be the only way to go. Maybe we missed something last time. Is there another way out of here which we might have missed? Could have been quite easily. Go along it. Okay, there's a room here which we didn't actually see last time. Oh my god. Um, we've gone in a loop. That's a loop, isn't it? Or does it want us to think it's a loop? Maybe it's not a loop. This looks, is it, This is different, isn't it? Who gave you the right? Yes, this is a different place. So it was identical looking, wasn't it? No, maybe it's the same place. I feel like this is a different place, but it just wants you to think. You've gone in a circle. Right, so that is going to be the end of this episode. Obviously, hopefully everyone has enjoyed. Obviously, thanks again for the developers for the code. I've actually already recorded the next episode. I tried to do like an extra long video, but share factor in its limitations. It was only an hour. So unfortunately I couldn't. So I've had to split it up into two. The next episode will be in the next couple of days. But hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. Obviously, you will find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and obviously to the merch store. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it from me. Uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Obviously do pop all your thoughts in the comments below. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Thanks all for coming in. Take care. See ya.